Hi, I'm Gina Ventola, Practice Manager for Ventola Law. One of the best parts of my job is meeting with business owners. However, at times, it can be difficult to meet in person. That's why I started this show, to introduce you to local business owners in our community. Join me on your virtual coffee, a new kind of networking. everybody, welcome to Your Virtual Coffee, the web show that introduces you to great local businesses in the Denver metro area. Today, I'm so excited. My guest is Catherine Capalupi, Business Development Manager for Red Rocks Credit Union. Catherine uses her incredible personality to create relationships with mortgage brokers, community leaders, and dealerships to increase production establish new memberships, and share business. As a credit union, Red Rocks Credit Union's ultimate accountability is to their employees, families, and the community, not shareholders or profits. Because of this, they strive to be good stewards of your money by providing the care, responsiveness, and ease of business they deliver to their own family. When you have a question, Red Rocks Credit Union makes it so easy for you to speak to a real person with real solutions. How cool is that? How many of us have had to deal with those, you know, robos, robo operators? But with Red Rocks, you get a real person. And speaking of real people, Catherine, welcome to my show. Thanks for having me today. So Catherine, we like to do business with people we like, know, and trust. And with that being said, I'd kind of like to get to know you a little bit more. So where did you grow up? Yeah, I grew up um, in Northern California. Um, was raised there from the time I was about three years old on. And then once I graduated college, I moved to Colorado in 2006. Now, growing up in Northern California, what was your favorite subject in school? Um, my favorite subject in school was, oddly enough, biology. Um, I loved forensic science before um, like CSI even came out. I was obsessed with learning um, all about, like, it's so morbid, but how, pe how long people have been dead. I did this project in high school where we had um, to figure out how long the squirrel had been dead and everyone was grossed out and I did the entire class project by myself because I was so into it. Um, weird, but yeah, and then college, I did biology and chemistry, science, um, and then I did that for about six months and then moved to Colorado and got into sales and banking. So very different, but I like banking and sales a lot more. <laughs> <laughs> so what gets you excited about banking? Um, what I like about banking, especially working at Red Rocks, um, I really like helping people along their journey. Um, you know, whether it's buying a car or buying a home or even, you know, unfortunately going through a divorce, something like that. I like being able to be there for people in whatever, you know, time of life that they're in. So how can Red Rocks Credit Union help people? Yeah, um, there's a lot of things that we can do. One, um, we are a smaller um, credit union, so it's not like a big bank. If you have an issue or um, want help, you can call me directly, um, which is really nice. Um, we have auto loans. We have a really great program right now, especially in you know the crazy economic times um, that we're in. You know, we um, have a debt elimination loan, so if you need help with cash flow, um, we can help with that. Um, we have great second mortgage products and HELOCs so that if you needed to pay for college for your um, child or, you know, do those home improvements that you've been putting off, um, those are great options. So there's a lot. We have free checking accounts, free savings accounts. Um, so we have, we have a whole gamut of things at Red Rocks. What makes Red Rocks Credit Union different or um, unusual from other credit unions or banks? Yeah, so um, the one really awesome thing about Red Rocks is we're mainly over the phone and online. 
So um, we save a lot of overhead that way. Um, we have one branch in Highlands Ranch and then one in the Lockheed Martin um, facility because we were originally a Lockheed Martin credit union. Uh, but anybody in Colorado um, can be a member of Red Rocks. Uh, but we're different because again, we do mainly everything online and over the phone. So we make it easy for you, no matter where you are within the state. Um, so I'm able to do loans for people in Grand Junction or Vail, um, Colorado Springs versus just only doing the Denver Metro area. So it's really nice. Now, Catherine, let's talk about Power Partners. And for our audience, Power Partners are those businesses who target the same ideal client, but are not competing with each other. For example, a, a hairstylist and maybe a personal trainer. They both tend to target people who want to look good. And so they work together. Like they could probably pass referrals back and forth, but it's not where they're competing for the same client. So yeah. with that incredibly convoluted explanation, Catherine, who is your ideal client? Yeah, so um, my ideal power partners are, um, I would say financial planners. Well, let's take a step back to the ideal oh. client first. Oh, the ideal client, yes. yes. Sorry about that. That's um, okay. Ideal client would be anybody that is um, buying a house, or wanting to refinance their house, or buying a car, um, or anybody that is um, maybe wanting to help their cash flow monthly, maybe save some money, consolidate debt, that, those types of things. Okay, so with that ideal client in mind, um, you named a couple of them as far as power partners. Um, you mentioned financial planners, mortgage brokers. Yep, and then realtors. And realtors. I'm gonna throw a monkey wrench in this. I think you actually have another one, and that would be bankruptcy attorneys who focus on debtor work. And I'll tell you why. There is a um, exemption that someone who's filing bankruptcy can use towards their home so that it's safe from creditors. However, if they have too much equity in their home, they would have to surrender that. They would have to sell the house or they would have to do something to surrender that to the trustee. Whereas if instead the bankruptcy attorney sent them to you, you could help them perhaps with a HELOC, help them pay off their debt, and then perhaps maybe not have to file for bankruptcy. Yeah, that's a great idea. Or on the flip side of that, if you find someone who's just really, I mean, because you have background checks and credit checks that you have to do, I'm sure, that someone's just, it, they're just really struggling. And you realize, you know what, I'm probably not the best solution for you, but maybe talking to a bankruptcy attorney could help you with that. So I yeah. think actually, I hadn't thought about it until we just started talking about it. Um, which makes you different from a mortgage broker, because is it correct that right. most mortgage brokers do not do those household line, equity lines of credit, correct? That's correct. That mo um, there are some companies that do, but most um, lender, mortgage lenders or mortgage brokers do not, and they will actually refer their clients to me for that. Um, but yeah, that's a great um, out-of-the-box kind of thinking with the bankruptcy attorney. Um, a few years ago, I actually had a bankruptcy attorney um, power partner and we did, we were able to um, give business back and forth to each other um, for quite some time. And then she ended up moving out of state. And so then we just lost touch and um, I should go back and talk to you about some bankruptcy. <laughs> well, I'll have to research my Rolodex, but um, I know some of them in town for our audience. I actually, that was the first job I had out of college was working as a bankruptcy paralegal. So it's kind of my first love, one of my first loves. And so anytime I hear something that, you know, bankrupt the world of bankruptcy, it's like, it gets kind of piques my interest. Um, so now that we kind of understand who your power partners are, who your ideal client is, Catherine, what is the best way 
for people to reach out to you? Yeah, the best way is either by phone or email. Um, my phone number is 303-471-7645, or you can email me at ccapalupi at redrocks.org, and I'll spell that because it's a little bit uh, difficult. Um, it's C C A P is in Paul I L U he is in Paul I at Red Rocks with an S dot org O R G. Wonderful, and I'll include a slide at the end that will have this sure. information. So, um, and I usually leave it as the last. So when people watch the video, if you watch it to the end, you get all Catherine's information, including the best way to contact her. So Catherine, any last thoughts for our viewers? You know, I think just the takeaway is um, the thing that I really love about Red Rocks that is so different than any other credit union bank is just that we really care about our members and, you know, they give feedback and we listen so that we're better. Um, whereas, you know, there are some institutions that don't do that. You take the surveys and they just throw them away or they don't do anything with those surveys. Um, you know, we really care about our employees. We want the best for our employees and our fam and their families. And it really is like working with a family. Um, and I just, there's not too many places out there like that. So um, I have all my banking there uh, because I know that they care about me as an employee and me as a member. So um, that's probably my biggest takeaway, I think, for, for Red Rocks. I love that. Catherine, thank you so much for coming on my show. Thank you. Audience, thank you for joining us today on your virtual coffee. We could not do this show without you. Thank you for watching and be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Business owners, let's talk. Have a great day. Your virtual coffee is sponsored by Ventola Law. Ventola Law mediation and legal representation at an expert level. You can find them at ventolalaw.com. Thanks for joining me today. For more information on your virtual coffee, check us out on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and wait for it, our website at yourvirtualcoffee.com. Thanks again for watching and have an incredible day.